Hey, hello everyone. I'm back live for our Lima Laser live chat with Lucy, the founder of Lima. I'm so sorry that we had a technical difficulty and we're gonna give another chance here. I can see Lima has joined the chat and as soon as they request, I will let them in. Hi. Sorry, I'm so sorry. It cut me off and then Yeah, what happened was on our it would, I couldn't see a button to ask to rejoin. Yeah, I think it froze and so there was nothing we could do but just close it and restart. So well, let's a wonderful, start. <laughs> a wonderful technical difficulty. Maybe, time, maybe like, because it's like a terrible storm. Oh maybe. Yeah, maybe the Maybe God just running. wanted to <laughs> So, Lucy, thank you so much for taking the time to be in this live with me and the community and everyone that's joined today. This is really, really exciting because there's so much buzz about this laser. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I know we had got so many questions that came in over across all the social media channels that I posted on. And I checked earlier and we have people joining from all over the world right now so like it's morning in la well, evening in london I'm here to answer everything because obviously it's a new piece of technology people are questioning it people have got lots of questions and we love questions because i can answer them all Absolutely. or i can try and answer yeah. them all <laughs> i had mentioned that we have so many that i don't know if we'll get through all of them but i think we should definitely dive in and, and start um getting into some of the questions. I think the first question would be just to explain the difference between LED and laser light because that comes up, I think, the most and that would be really great unless there's another one that you'd rather tackle first. No, no, let's, let's jump in because this is the question that we get asked the most. Right. So the Lima laser is not an LED. It has LEDs on the outside of it, which is the red light that you can see. But that is literally just to tell you that the device is switched on. So it's a switch on and off switch. Inside of here is a 500 milliwatt near infrared laser. And before the Lima laser came about, the legal limit for at home beauty lasers was between five and 20 milliwatts. And this is 500 milliwatts. So it's a whole new category of power. And the difference between LED and laser is the actual light structure. So LED has certain light properties and laser has certain light properties. LED is, um, is a scattered light. It's a light that runs in all different directions. It's a wavy light. It goes here, there and everywhere. And the, the, the thing about LED is that, and, and that's why it's so amazing to put in a bulb in the ceiling or anywhere that you want to flood light into a big space. But laser light is a coherent light source. It's, a, it's like a laser beam, it's like a needle. It's a different light structure and it has different light properties. A laser light is coherent monochromatic and polarized. Those are the three properties of laser light. And the difference between LED and laser is that laser can penetrate through a dense surface like the skin. LED can't penetrate through the dense surface. So LED, because it's a, this wavy light source, when it hits a dense surface like the skin, it bounces off the surface. And if I'm being really, really technical, and this might be too technical, there's a difference that the, the, uh, the, you, the, the, the color of LED, so the frequency of LED is exactly the same as the frequency of laser. So the color, which is the frequency, is the same whatever the light source. So whether that's blue, near infrared, um, green, yellow, whatever that might be. But there's another property that you need to consider to the light source if, it is go if it's going to have a healing effect. And that's what's called the absolute penetration. And the absolute penetration for healing has only ever been scientifically proven if it's monochromatic, coherent, 
and polarized. I nearly forgot the third one. <laughs> and that's because that's the part of the light that has the potential to heal. So that's why LED, when it bounces off the surface of the skin, is amazing at healing, the very surface of the skin. But it cannot penetrate through to the dermis without losing the majority of its power. And that's where the Lima laser comes in, because the Lima laser can penetrate all the way through the skin, past the fat and muscle tissue, without losing power. So it has a healing ability way below the skin surface. And that is why the Lima laser has been proven to be more powerful than LED. And there's a scientific study that's been done that that's proves this technology to be a hundred times more powerful than LED, not on the very surface of the skin, but in the base layer, the dermis. Is there a way that we could read that study? Could I get that from you later? I can email email it through to you yes that would be amazing i would well, it's, love to take a look. it's in, it's uh it's not in english but yeah i can send it to you oh no <laughs> my audience is very geeky about all the tech specs on these devices so that that would be really i think fascinating um and i will say that i wasn't sure when i first started the laser because i saw all these comments flying around and i'm like let me just get a hold of this and test it and see like what what do i see what results do i see and i'm quite amazed like my skin has never looked this good i did a 12 week test and now I use it a couple times a week. I was before using it every day and my skin is looking like really smooth and it works for me. I mean, that's the thing, like I can't speak the to anybody else. It's impossible for it not, <laughs> if you are a human, it's impossible, it, 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 no human, you know, we might all look different, but we're all made up of the same cells and it's impossible for it not to work because fundamentally, if you put this laser over your skin, so the lens is touching your skin, the light will reach the dermis. And it's, it's really important that the light reaches the dermis because that's the level of the skin where the fibroblasts are, where the building blocks of your skin. So you can't rebuild the skin from the, from the top part because the top part is dead and it's right. not all dead, right. but you know, right. it's the part that's about to, go away but the the foundation of your skin is the dermis and that's why this is so revolutionary you can sit under a, um, an led lamp for hours and it will not get rid of a scar you know and so you can test it very easily this will go all the way past the dermis into the fat and muscle tissue and that's why i don't know whether you've noticed that you have a bit of a lifting effect yeah like from the lima laser yeah. Like, because you're, you're actually regenerating your muscle that sits below the skin as well. So it does give you like, um, a I mean, I, I'm 50 and I've just walked in from the, from a day in the office and, 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 and it's raining and it's not nice. And I don't feel like a 50 year old woman with no makeup on who's just walked in from a, a, a day in the office, you know, like it might, your skin just has, a life and a glow. I agree. And I agree. It's pretty incredible. And I saw that for myself. Like, I'm like, does this thing work? And a month in, I'm like, yeah, this thing works. Yeah. And that's funny because a question came in. They want to know, does Lucy use it? Does Lucy use the laser? And you just said you do. Of course use I use the laser. <laughs> I think that's great. No, well, my, know, I sit in bed every night and I have half an hour where I use the laser. And I don't use it on my face every day now because I'm in maintenance mode. So right. I might. Uh, do it on my chest or uh, a c-section scar or uh, you know there's loads of areas my knees if I feel as though my knees need a bit of a revive you know there's plenty of areas that um that, that I can use it on okay. and that's my laser time a question that came in through the chat that I just saw which I think is a great question that we may have glazed over but what does the laser do oh. what would people use well that's for? a good question I know. <laughs> so you can use Use the laser for lots of different things. Um, it will help with pigmentation. So, uh, you know, I, uh, I like to tan in the sun and I spent the summer in Spain and it just means at the end of the summer, I don't end up looking really speckled with pigmentation. So it gets rid of pigmentation, rosacea, which I don't suffer from, but it's really amazing at taking the redness away from rosacea. Obviously it doesn't get rid of the root cause of rosacea, but it, it gets rid of the, the, the redness on your skin. Thread veins, 
wrinkles, elasticity, scars, even really old scars, um, bruising, lifting, and you know, you can use it on your face or anywhere on your body. So, or your neck. I mean, your neck is is an area that is just very, very hard to keep on top of. And I always felt as though the neck was my giveaway. Um, and I, I like to, twice a week I'll do my neck. And I always make sure if you do your neck, start here, yeah. start at the jawline, because that holds up your neck. <laughs> yeah, I like to always get into this area here. Yeah. And that question as well, like where can I use it? Can I use it on my neck? you use it on your chest you said yes use it on your yeah. chest and like the back of your hands you can use it on back your, of your hands knees. there's nowhere where you can't use it obviously if you're pregnant you can use it on your everywhere on your body but not on your over where the baby is and if you've got an overactive thyroid so not an underactive one but an overactive thyroid you shouldn't place it over the thyroid if it's overactive place it there or hair, but not that. And then and also spider veins. You talked about scars and spider veins that will treat those conditions as spider well. Spider veins, you can use it on spider veins or thread veins as they're known um, over here. You use it slightly differently. You hold it over the thread vein for 10 minutes every day. And in a few weeks, it will be gone. Somebody has just asked actually um, if you can use it on Asian skin and yes. It, because it's a zero damage laser, so it does not rely on damaging uh, any cell in order to stimulate collagen, you can use it on darker skin tones. And that is a breakthrough for inclusive beauty. So traditionally, you shouldn't use lasers on darker skin tones. But because this is no damage, you can, it's safe to use on all skin types and tones. Somebody's actually yeah, that said, can I use it on uh, teenagers? Teenage acne scars, and yes, we've got some really good uh, case studies with teenage acne scars. Um, you, for scars, you use it slightly differently. You hold it over each section of the scar for three minutes twice daily, um, and you'll notice it depends on the nature of the scar. If it's um, not a keloid scar, then it should go within uh, three or four months. If it's a keloid scar, that will take longer, but it will smooth out. Yeah, and that question comes in a lot, like how long will it take before I see results? And what I noticed is that it's different for every person. It's like I use mine okay, for everyone. I use mine. Every I mean, day. I'd love to say it's the same for everybody, but it's not. Everybody's skin's different. Everybody comes with a different benchmark. So um, maybe you've got a wrinkle that's really, really deep set that you've had for 20 years. That's going to take longer to treat than... Uh, you know, a tiny bit of skin elasticity issue. Um, so everybody's got different um, issues that they want to that they want to solve. You've just got to keep going with it until you're happy with the results, and that's um, you know the, the the best advice that we can give. But always take a before shot. So always take a really good before picture of the area that you want to treat, because because you can't feel it. So it's completely cold you can't feel it and you think is it working because you see your skin every day and so you think is it working because you associate pain with results and i promise if you use it every day and you take a picture four eight and twelve weeks later you will be astounded at the results i i agree with you i think consistency is key with any beauty device at home and especially with this one i did use it every single day and the first month in is when i started to see really drastic results in just my skin looking so smooth and glowy and then after i finished that 12-week test is when i really started to notice my jowls tightening up you know so there was things happening across the test but i saw results pretty quickly because of my baseline so it just depended like you know what i was trying to get out of it and i'm thrilled by the laser so i wouldn't be on here with you doing this live if i didn't i mean as part of our um uh, as part of our FDA submission, we did a clinical study that was actually, well, it, it wasn't a clinical study, it was, it was a case study on, um, that was published in Aesthetic Surgery Journal on a 75-year-old woman who was very wrinkled, um, and the results were really incredible. 
So it's not that we've just tested it on young people that have got not a lot wrong with their skin. We've tested it on a whole host of parameters. Well, thank you for alluding to the fact that I may be young in your yeah. eyes at 48. <laughs> well, you I appreciate young. that. And you look like you've got amazing skin. Well, you know, this is really helping. So thank you. <laughs> thank you. Um, going to just look through these questions here. Um, so a question that comes in a lot is, you know, my community uses a lot of different modalities like microcurrent, um, radio frequency, LED. Can they use the laser with their other modalities? You or can like use the laser with anything, but you probably find that you don't need to use the other tools. Microcurrent's good if you want a, an immediate lift, if you're going somewhere and you want an immediate lift. Um, but you, you wouldn't have to use LED because this is a light technology that's a lot stronger. Well, it's just good to know because people have like like me i have like elaborate routines and it's good to know that this plays with anything because there's some radio frequency you know you wouldn't radio frequency obviously is, is a technology that damages cells in order to um stimulate growth so you, you wouldn't need to use um radio frequency with it but if you want an if you're going somewhere and you wanted a you know a, a lift then it's you know you can use microcurrent alongside it got it <laughs> i'm looking through here you had already talked about how it helps helps with hyperpigmentation i will say that that is true it really helped mine after my grease trip i had so much and it just with consistent use i was quite amazed as soon as i got back from my trip it really lightened up this like forehead and cheek melasma that i had yeah. like yeah it, it is a, but you just don't feel it working right so you just think is it working? Isn't it working? And that's why I just say it's amazing to uh, if you do take before and afters, because then you can actually track. Just seeing somebody said, can you use it around your eyes? And yes, you can. You can use it around the area. You can use it on top of your eyelid. It's got retina uh, protected technology inside of here. So you can, I mean, we don't advise looking at it, but you don't need to wear goggles. <laughs> So I could like use it on my hooded eyes because I'm, I'm usually nervous to use something like near my eye, but I could do that. Yeah, totally. The way to do it is just hold it still. Yeah. Oh, hold it still. Oh, for like three minutes. Yeah. That's a good one. And I can also do this like over makeup if I yeah. had to, right? I mean, sometimes it doesn't. I mean, I don't like that sticky feeling that you get with makeup. I don't I mean, know. I don't like it's it, but if I'm going to use it then i mean i'm doing it right now <laughs> lift yeah, you can use it uh, uh, with the sun factor on because the um infrared the near infrared end of the spectrum is different to the uv um is tretinoid cream for pigmentation i think it's somebody said it can use it with um tretinoid cream i think that's for pigmentation you can use oh. it with anything Oh, they're asking if they can use tretinoin with it. That's a question that comes in with every device I'm ever talking about. Yeah. I absolutely use my tret. That's retin-A. Oh, retinoid, I absolutely retinol. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you can use it with retinol. Yeah. And the tret is the prescription, and I haven't had any problems with that. So I wanted to just quickly, like we're quite like 20 minutes in, I wanted to ask if we could mention our special announcement about the deal. Yes. <laughs> we should have mentioned this earlier but it was a teaser now that we've got more people joining um we are offering a 24-hour flash sale where you can save 10 percent on the laser i have never seen this we never discount I, the laser i've never seen this you guys <laughs> i asked i was like please 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 can we get you begged and we said sale? yes <laughs> please please and we got it 10 percent off so i have the link in my bio right now for the next 24 hours you can go tap through that link in my bio and shop it'll take you directly to a special page you enter your email and you get access to the special 10 percent off page so it would be a great time to grab the laser if you've been looking to shop it because honestly i've i've seen it on sale like once before around the holidays it's like when wild. we, we Never. were b Call certified and to celebrate we're the first device company in the world to uh, get b Call certification and we were so pleased that we uh, we gave um, uh, a discount for two days. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you so much. I'm sure the community is really going to appreciate it. People are asking, "Where's the link?" The link is in my bio. 
my Instagram bio. I've got it right there. You go to my profile and you tap right there. There's the link. It'll take you right to the page where you can shop. So, um, oh, it's so good to see people commenting that they're seeing great results. Somebody just said they're seeing great results oh, on their neck. Somebody the neck. said that they just got it and they're seeing great results just a couple weeks in and their skin is looking really smooth. So I, I find that the people that actually use it and take the photo to track the results are yeah. seeing results. And for me, like, I think that it's sometimes you can't really see the results from photos when as much as like, I would just be looking in the mirror at myself, putting on my makeup, getting ready. And I'm like, wow, like my skin <laughs> is looking. I love myself. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, no, but skin, my job. skin can make you feel good or bad. I mean, it's my it's, job. It's job to, a benchmark. Yeah. And I, I mean, I wouldn't be going around town being like, look at me, I look so good. But I was, it gave me a boost of confidence. It's, it's like, very good. It's very good. <laughs> it gave um, me a boost of confidence because I'm, you know, pushing 50 and, you know, you start to get insecure. And this just was making me feel like I'm able And you can like just, just do it on your own time. You know, you don't have to think, oh, no, I've got to book in an appointment at the clinic and you can just... Yeah, I do it in your own time. It became part of my routine while I was watching uh, like a, a TV show. So I would put Succession. the TV show on and I just didn't even really like realize I was using it. I would do it for 30 minutes, 33 minutes. And I just got so used to it. It's so easy to use because you just have to put on the spray and the serum. And then you just, I would just glide it along. Yeah. And hold it on. It was, it just became so quick. You don't need to like sit in the mirror and follow a, an elaborate tutorial and that's sometimes the issue with the other devices I have where I stop using it because I just can't deal or I don't want to do the technique. There is really no technique other than gliding it in the yeah. area, holding it in the areas that you're trying to treat and that's what makes it easier than I think and, any other and device. And somebody's actually just asking if you have to use it with the mist and the glide. You can use it with any, with, with any skincare but um, Either the Lima skincare, so the serum and the cream, or the mist and the glide, you can use it with. Um, I use it with the Lima skincare, I have to say. I use the, the glide and the spray, and then I use some other oils because I don't have that skincare yet, but I, I really do like these products. You can see this one is getting kind of empty. That is amazing because it's like an oxygen mask. So it actually is very, very good for your skin because after the age of... 40 your skin loses 60 percent of its oxygen and so that's got bioavailable oxygen it's very very good and collagen and elastin and all those great menopausal issues and so yeah using the products and the laser will, will restore oxygen collagen elastin and gives you that anti-aging effect so it's yeah. really wonderful but actually it is amazing for the neck i forget how down my i, I just felt very down at my neck and now i feel so I'm proud of my neck. See, it does have a confidence boosting effect. It does have a good, it did for me. For me, for, for sure. Um, okay, so I'm going through these questions here. Um, so people are asking again, like, when should I use it? How long should I use it? And I think what really helped me is connecting with the Lima concierge. And they talked with me about like what my concerns were and came up with a program for yeah. me that I yeah. followed. Is that available to everyone? So everybody, you can figure out everybody that buys a Lima laser, you can get in touch with our incredible concierge and they will answer any questions. They've got bespoke treatments for each, each individual issue that you might have. Uh, they can help you along the way. They're amazing. If you've got a life problem, they can help with a life problem. <laughs> That's good to know because I have some you of those. Them as a friend. I have some of those right now um so um why? Question. what's up why? um question i have is about those the, the case study you talked about the case study and the the study about the the low level laser technology do you have any clinical trials that are scheduled for the laser we've or? done lots of clinical trials with the laser um we've even done um skin biopsies um, on the dermis. We, we, we've done lots and lots and lots of different tests to know how it works for different eventualities. Is there a way that we can take a look at that or is it on the website? If you, no, we don't put them on the website because you're not allowed to put them on the oh, website. Okay. 
um, because um, they were some of them were done on um, the dermis and therefore it's not a standard beauty um, trial. So uh, you can contact our concierge and we, we're happy to share any of the results. Okay, thank you for that. I'm sure that will be an exciting thing for people. Um, I want to see, please keep your comments coming in the live. If anyone has a question that hasn't been answered, please keep those coming in because Lucy can see those as well as me. And I'm going through the list here. I think we've answered almost everything. One of the questions that came in a lot was, how is the laser different from the Nero laser? Because that's a laser. And I already know that the Nero laser is a heat based laser that causes damage to stimulate collagen and elastin. So and, that and laser is just a, uh, it's not an expensive technology. It um, uses the laser light to um, create thermal damage in water tissues. So it heats the cells up, creates damage, and then uh, stimulates collagen production. This is entirely different. It is, uh, this laser will last you 10 years and it, it doesn't damage any cell in order to renew. So it's a totally, totally different and technology. It's this cold. is way superior. But it's cold. And this is cold, you can't it's feel cold. it. Yeah. Like, that comes it's like lot. saying, what's the, you know, a sheep and a cow are both animals, but they're very different. But that comes up a lot about heat because like I suffer from melasma and a lot of people are nervous about heat. And I tell people, you know, this is great because it is cold. The mirror There's is hot. There's no heat there at is, all. There is no heat. And if you feel heat while you're moving it across your face, that's generally from it's friction. Circulation. From circulation. Yeah. Circulation. Improved circulation, which is great. But it's not, if you leave it, if you turn it on and leave it on your table and pick it up, it's cold. Like I, I, I do that often just because people comment all the time and I'm like, no, it's, it's cold. So that question came up a lot. So thank you for answering that. And a question just came through in the chat about Botox. So like if yeah, you, you can Botox, use it, um, if you've got Botox, you can use it straight after you can use it with fillers after a facelift after surgery. Before, but would it replace Botox? So like my whole thing is, alternatives to injectables because I haven't done them yet. So I'm using this so that I don't have to get them uh, maybe later. But if you know, if I'm getting Botox now, would I be able to use this and then kind of wean, wean myself off of injectables? Everyone has injectables for different reasons, but your skin will gain elasticity. So you might find that you don't need it. Got it. That was a good question that came in. Um, so I feel like we've answered almost all of the questions. I wanted to... People are asking if there's a new version coming out. No. <laughs> oh, yeah. I did see that come through. Yeah, no. Um, this is the most powerful at-home laser. Um, maybe, actually, it was because um, this has got a red light. And in the rest of the world, the red light is a blue light. So when you switch the device on, it's a blue light that comes on. It's the same near infrared laser inside. It's completely identical. Got it. This is just the light to tell you the device is switched right. on. Right. And mine is red as well. If you yeah. the red if, if light doesn't do anything, it just tells you the device is switched on. If you have just joined, I wanted to remind you that we have a special 10% flash sale available to all of the viewers today. Thank you so much, Lucy, for making that available. The link is in my bio. Hello. If you want to shop. Somebody else has just said, I'm 57. Will it lift and tighten my jaw? Yes, it will. If you use it every day for 12 weeks, you will notice a great lifting. I saw a lift when I used it every day for 12 weeks. Like right here, it was very tight. Like I tightened it up. And this is my number one. Um, it says, video. how does this compare to medical grade laser? This is a medical grade laser. So this is the first clinic grade laser that's ever been cleared for at home use. It's 500 milliwatts. And then somebody's asking, can they use it to lift their, like to do like a brow lift? Well, it's not gonna do a brow, it's not gonna lift your brow, no. <laughs> it, it, it will tighten the skin around your eye, but it won't lift your face, you know, it's not going to physically lift. This area here is different because this is um, drooping through loss of elasticity and loss of muscle tone. But your eye area is different. 
but you can definitely tighten the skin around your eye 100 percent so just, just a time check here we're at we're at four after the hour do you have time to keep going or do you need to sign off soon or should we keep asking because i see more questions coming through so how long should you use it per treatment if you're using it for the face allow 30 minutes for the face you can use it for longer if you're sitting sitting watching a film for an hour and a half use it for an hour and a half if you're using it for the neck that will be about another 10 minutes so it's about 15 minutes per treatment area and you, this area here is probably a treatment area and the way that you use it is you just very 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 slowly glide over or you if you've got a small Smaller area, you can just hold it over each section of the uh, uh, each section of the skin that you want to treat for three minutes, and then move on to the next section. I saw a question come through asking about the warranty about this device. Can you speak to that? Two, I don't know. Two years. Two, two years. Okay, there's a two, two year warranty, but the light will last you ten years. And actually, this is another really important thing to say when you get it charge the battery before you use it and char if you're using it every day charge the battery every other day because the red light will still come on when the wet when the laser is weak so always make sure that you charge it every other day don't wait for the whole device to stop i found that it charges very quickly as well so i just had i put it after i've used it at night i put it in the charging dock and 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 i it's then fine for the next morning yeah and i mean even if i am charging it during the day because sometimes i do that and i find that it charges really really quickly and it's it's really easy to do you just take the top off and you can flag the battery out and put it in the little charger and it's really quite easy i'll say compared to any other devices what other questions have come through did you check any how do you oh. Oh, if it's ever malfunctioning because you can't feel it well you see there's a tiny red dot in the middle of the device and that is the laser so you can kind of always see it but you you the laser's there it's just inside of her i mean i would if, say that if the device the, switches on it, and it's charged means like, no that the charged. battery is working and it will just come on you'll if the device you don't see a red light there when you switch it on then it's not working but so just make sure that you keep the battery charged i didn't have any problem with that over the 12 weeks i just made sure that i charged it every other day and it was totally fine and it worked so yeah Ooh, Good for question. cellulite yes it's amazing for cellulite i used it around my knees i had cellulite around my knees slowly glide it over this over the area that you want to treat i did 15 minutes each knee and it was amazing got rid of all the cellulite i think the cellulite is hereditary even whatever you can drink all the water in the world and you'll still get it i've had it almost my whole life even from when i was very young as a dancer so i, I was a hereditary dancer as well did you do ballet yeah i did yeah yeah so did I. Teddy ballet yeah and i've got I've, i was doing ballet with cellulite so Never do ba it's ballerinas i know Woo. uh yeah uh, we shipped to germany we shipped to 70 countries nationwide so you can always get the lima laser oh that's good to know because the audience that that's tuning in i'm sure is very global so you can get it um globally Okay. Um, you can use any serum or cream, but we, if you're going to use a serum and cream, the Lima skincare is incredible because they, it's, it's got actives that has been, that have been engineered to work alongside the laser. So this replaces any, this replaces your whole skin protocol in terms of serums, moisturizers, eye creams. These two products are incredible. They are, it's medical grade. It's very, very potent. Over 80% of the formulation is actually made up of the actives and less than 20% is made up of the, of water and emulsifiers. This is, this is incredible. It's the best serum and cream. I would, 
love to check it out. I'm going to go to the website and see the ingredients. I'm, I'm really into it. Um, a question that came in a few times I saw is, can you share it with your teenager? Like if you're both going to use it and yeah. I would say just clean it off with, I just have these alcohol just wipes. Put the wipe on it. And, and yeah, it's amazing. I use it. Um, I, uh, my daughter, when she had chicken pox, she had like a very bad first one that came through and it's scarred and she doesn't like it. So I used it on her shoulder and she was happy. Yeah, I, I can't see how it would have any, you'd have any problem because it's flat. Like this area is flat. So you just clean it off with an alcohol wipe. That's what I do and anybody could use it. I mean, in, yeah. your, in your household. Um, let's see, I'm just going through these questions. So where can you buy it? There's a link right in my bio. You can 10 off. at 10% off, 24 hour flash sale. I asked if we could get a sale. You know what, somebody we said it's the flash sale for skincare too. And if the concierge is on here, yes, it can be for the skincare too. I don't know how, how they're going to do that. But if you contact the concierge, they will uh, sort you out with a discount. Yeah, because the link takes you right to a special page with the 10% code so, already. Then uh, contact the concierge and say uh, that you, that I said you could have 20, 10% Thank off. Thank you. That's so, that's so, so generous. I'm really looking forward to trying that skincare. It looks like it's pretty amazing. Um, let's see. Any other questions? They oh. say, what's the difference between the blue and red light? The blue and the red light that you see is just the light that tells you the device is switched on. And it's red in the US and red blue in the US, US, blue um, everywhere else. It's the near infrared laser light that's the power, but you can't see near infrared. It's invisible to the human eye. So it's there, but you can't see it. We just had a wave of people just join. Thank you for joining. <laughs> we, hi, we are just in conversation with Lucy about the Lima laser and we've already answered so many questions about the laser, um, but we do have a special 10% off flash sale going on through the link in my bio if you wanna tap through very, very special deal going on right now if you wanna shop the laser. But um, I don't think that we have many more questions. Is there anything else? Lucy, that you wanted to cover today? Any other burning, burning topics or questions that you wanted to go over about the laser or the skincare before we? No, decide? I think just if you have got questions, then definitely contact our concierge. Um, they can help with anything, and I appreciate it's an investment. Um, you know, you will have questions. You will want to know. Everybody's got different issues that they want to address. It's a new piece of technology to the beauty industry but it's been around in hospitals since the 1960s. So it's not a new piece of technology in the world. Um, so yeah, just get in contact with our concierge. Thank it does you. work with spider veins, yes. And I see another question. I will take this video and, and I'll post it on my social media in case you joined late or you didn't get some of your questions answered because you didn't see the whole video, I'll make sure that I post that on my social media channel so that you can go take a look. And I thank you so much, Lucy, for being thank here. Thank you so much. It's been so lovely to meet you. You as well. And I, I love hearing everybody's stories about how the lasers help them. So it's, that's the reason we set Lima up to help people with problems that they face. So. It's, it's wonderful. It's amazing to see a beautiful, happy woman in front of me. <laughs> well, well, thank you so much for making a device that I love so much and continue to use. A lot of the, the devices I test and then I move on to the next device, I'm actually still using this in maintenance a couple of times, two to three times a week because I love it that much and that's that's the truth. So well, that, I that think makes me happy. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. Okay, bye everyone. Thank you for having me me and if anyone's got a question um let us know and we will help you and we'll answer you wonderful thank you so much take care Bye. lovely to see you bye, -bye.